My name is Colin Bell. My name is Jody Stroud. And together we are going to brew our version of the Innocent Gun Bartender's Choice. Our favourite ingredients, rum, chocolate and orange. So we're going to try and combine these flavours and make our own special Innocent Gun. Okay, so in goes the barley wine mix. It's a thick, treacly substance full of everything that you need to make a nice beer. We've crushed up our cocoa beans and we've added boiling water to that, so that's going to go into our mix. Gonna get all of everything that's in the tin is gonna go in that mix. Here we add part of the magic, of course the sugar turns uh, into alcohol and carbon dioxide when the yeast is added. Give this a good stir. So the next step we're going to do now is add our essence. So in the vessel we've got the barley wine, we've got the rum essence, we've got the orange essence, and we've also got our uh, chocolate, our cocoa mixture. We're going to add a bit more water, put some yeast into it, and then let the magic happen. So, we're at the final stages of the process. We're going to add the, uh, the yeast, which is going to react with the, the sugars and the, it's going to create alcohol and carbon dioxide. Um, yeast is a fantastic thing. Without yeast, we'd, we'd have no beer. So in it goes. We took the specific gravity of the wort, which came in at 308. So that's it. That's all our preparation work done. All we have to do now is uh, wait, basically, seven to ten days. Hopefully it should be ready. We should see a few bubbles coming up here through that time. We'll keep an eye on it, we'll move it. We're looking forward to bottling it, waiting for another seven, ten days, and giving it a taste. If it doesn't taste that good, well, we're not master brewers, but that's your job. Well, that's the end of a busy Saturday night. Indeed. There's nothing we like to do more than drink Innocent Gun. So, tonight we're not going to drink Innocent Gun. We're going to drink our own creation. As you saw earlier, we put uh, rum essence, orange essence and cocoa beans to get a, a unique chocolate flavour. So we're going to celebrate our, uh, our creation with some Santa Teresa rum orange. It's really good. We've got some. We've got some chocolate. Hopefully, this will complement our flavours. So this is exciting for us. This is the first time we've, we've uh, opened a bottle, and we're going to taste it. Nice and gently. Cleared really nicely. It's got some good head on there as well, hasn't it? Yeah, it is. It's consistent head. I've got better. I've got quite a lively one. Your yours is. It's more shy. Yeah. Anyways, let's see how it goes. Oh, cheers. 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 Can you feel the orange?
Can you taste the chocolate? And the rum. Not really. Me neither. <laughs> what happened? I don't know, but we're not master brewers. That's it. We've, we've got a bottle of, of our creation with your name on it because we want the innocent gun to have our name on it. 